Hi, my name is Sunday. In this video, I'll be talking about opportunity to get documents in Italy. Apply for special protection now. Are you out there? You are crying that you don't have documents. Or you get one person or the other, your friend, your brother, your sister. When you know, say no get documents, this one a big opportunity. You got to share this video out to that person. Make sure that this video gets straight to their hand. I've done a video about it before concerning special protection. Many people or some people have applied for it already, of which they have granted to some of them. Some of them are still waiting for it. Some people think say maybe in a room or maybe not they happen or maybe you can't apply for it. Even some lawyers even came out saying that it is not right, you cannot apply for it, that they should be careful. Many of them that apply for it, so I've gotten feedback, they have collected it or they have granted it to them already. Those ones we never hear and hear it now. Or you know, say your brother did you not get document? Let them know about what I'm about to say now. Opportunity is hard there because they have changed some kind of things in the decree in the law regarding documents. And now special protection that be the last one, even if they don't give you normal or the better one, but at least special protection. Your heart there, you don't get documents, they cry. They go from one place to the other, maybe from one renew to the other. Opportunity for you to get special protection. And special protection can be applied or can be requested direct from the questora. Even if you don't want to seek for asylum, you can get special protection, two years special protection direct from the questora. So we go into some details so you to understand the requirements and how to go about it. But first, I would love you to give this video a thumbs up by clicking the like button. And for those that have not subscribed to my YouTube channel or those that are not following me on my Facebook page, please do subscribe and also make sure you follow when you do. Make sure you click the notification bell so whenever I upload any new videos or information, you will know. Now let's get straight into it. It says, the good news is that now the permit for special protection can be requested by foreign citizens directly at the police headquarters and questora. You can directly request for it. Even if you don't go camp, you don't go one place or the other. Now in requesting for it, it is better, I've said it before, it is better going through lawyer. Look for a lawyer that will help you to request for special protection direct in questora. That is what you need to do. They said through a procedure that is completely independent from that relating to international protection, very different from that of the commission, very different from that of asylum. So that is what they stated. They said, furthermore, unlike before, now this permit for special protection can be converted into residence permit for work. So that is it. Unlike before, special protection, you can't convert it now. If they give you special protection two years, if you are working, you can convert it to Lavoro subordinate, which is work permit document. And as well, those ones in autonomous council convert it to autonomous document as well. So it's good thing hard there. It is time for you, those ones that have documents, or you are still hard there, you don't have it. Opportunity, opportunity. Don't miss this opportunity because they say, as the odds, you're quick it's and because things are changing. Things they change. Another regime will still come before you know it, like Savigny regime. When go still come again, before you know this opportunity, no go did there again. And many people at the end of it, they cry, oh, I wish I know, oh, I wish I never apply that time off. Oh, some people are crying because of things that have passed them already. Opportunity now, we are still crying, just like that of people that are coming from Germany. Many they cry, now oh, I wish I know, because then when they were coming, people came earlier and they have given their places, they have helped them. Now, Ukraine crisis don't take over, they don't help people again. So, quickly take hold of this opportunity. Some people don't already apply for special protection. Some lawyers, they say, you can't apply for it because you are not going to school, this, that, and that. Come on, dear. Not be everything lawyer. Some lawyers don't even know they are left from their right. Many people have gotten it. Number one, maybe they have just labor, they have work. They are working. And they have stayed in Italy for long. So, those are some situations that they look at. And secondly, your own country, the place you came from, if there are maybe different kinds of things that are happening there that will make them not report you back to that place. So there's guarantee that they must grant it to you. That is a final. They have stated it in law. 
that if they did not like those ones that have applied for asylum if they did not grant them asylum document asylum or subsidiary then the final one is special protection even negative now negative giving people negative now is somehow maybe rare so majority of people that have seen that have called me that applied for asylum majority currently currently they have given them special protection those ones that also applied directly to questura they have given them as well so people have completed as well so stop wasting time you don't have document or your brother don't have your friends don't have or in your church majority of people don't have tell it how to then this opportunity look for a lawyer you can apply for it so stop crying that i don't have document i don't have resident permit in a section that the person have committed one great crime or the other or one big crime or the other will make them not to grant or answer the person but if you know you are okay if you have not committed any crime then at the end of it all you apply for it they are going to grant it to you now let's look at the requirements some things that they look at before they can grant you this special protection it says what are the requirements to get it this is it the requirements you need to have before you can get this special protection or the things that they need to look at those ones that are here in italy if you want to apply for it now look into it it says number one the applicant's family ties in italy number one I have always said it that those people that have families opportunity opportunity for you to get documents you have family there are different ways to get documents here in Italy especially those that have family family ties if you have children you have wife you the man you don't have because of your family they will definitely grant it to you or you are applying together as family because of the family or the children you have here or the child you have or the wife you have here at the end of it, of special protection, two years be granted to you. Then number two, of its effective social integration in Italy. So this is where the lawyer was talking about that the person must have gone to one higher school or the other, have one certificate or the other, one degree. It does not really meet that one. Social integration it might be your work. It might be that you have been working here in Italy. You have life contract, one year contract, any type of contract you are working. People have gotten it. They don't go university. They don't get one certificate or the other. But because they are working, they only present their work contract and all that things. And at the end, they have granted it to them. So you don't waste time. Don't because of that lawyer say this, that, and that. Because of that, you don't want to go. Because you don't get certificates. You never go university. Not that one. Social integration. Those that have gone to school are included in this social integration. Those that are working are included in this social integration many other stuff that they look at if you have gone to school you have got one certificate or the other still good it's still good you still look at that one because of that one they still grant it to you so that is they say another thing is the, the duration of his stay in the national territory so this is another thing they also look at not that ev not that maybe everything when they get they want you know even though only one or two now they find in you they will grant it to you that is it then duration of stay you know, the person has spent more than three years for you. They did not mention any type of years for the duration. At least the person don't stay here in Italy. The person don't stay here small in Italy. It also be a miss for them to grant it to the person. So those are the things that they will also look at. You understand? So majorly that social integration. That is what they majorly look at. So when things are okay, you are working, you have family here, maybe you have gone to school, all those stuff. You have rights to apply for this special protection so go out there go apply for special protection you can go directly to questora either you do it by yourself or you do it through lawyer going through lawyer is more preferable like i've always said go through lawyer do you apply this special protection for you special protection are two years so this is all about special protection so as it the earth like what i talk go out there go apply for special protection they do the grant to many people i'm telling you they are granting it to many people so go out there, you don't have resident permit here in Italy, you don't have document, opportunity for you to apply, opportunity for you to get document, get or apply your special protection, apply for special protection. At the end of it all, then they are going to call you to get it. So in another subsequent video, in another video, I want to watch out for that video right now. If you have watched this video to this very minute, watch out for the other video consigning those ones that have applied for asylum. Because majority of people say that you can't apply for it if your asylum process is going on. That was what they said before. 
watch out for the second video those ones even those ones when they come those ones when they don't give rejected paper i mean those ones they don't give negative your case they are p watch out for that video what next you need to do consign special protection thank you and god bless you bye